Moroccan Spiced Goat Stew Ingredients 1 tablespoon cumin seeds 1 tablespoon caraway seeds 1 tablespoon fennel seeds 4 whole cloves 1 tablespoon cardamom seeds The tiny black seeds inside the pod 3 tablespoons Raz Al Hanout Spice Mix, or make your own 2 pounds, 900 grams, goat shoulder, cut into large chunks 5 to 6 ounces yogurt 1 quarter cup fresh mint leaves 2 cloves garlic, crushed 2 ounces, 55 grams, unsalted butter 6 tablespoons vegetable oil, divided 2 medium red onions, finely chopped 2 tablespoons freshly grated ginger 2 tablespoons tomato paste 3 cups, 750 milliliters, beef stock 1 quarter cup lightly packed cilantro leaves Directions Mix cumin seeds, caraway seeds, fennel seeds, whole cloves, cardamom seeds, and rat al out together in a small bowl Heat a large frying pan, sprinkle spice mix in and cook for one minute, shaking the pan constantly and taking care not to burn. Once cooked, tip the spice mix into a screw top jar and set aside. Gather stew ingredients as well as prepared spice mix. Pat the chunks of goat meat dry with a paper towel. Place meat into a bowl. Add the yogurt, mint, garlic, and stir well. Cover and place in the fridge and leave to marinate for a minimum of 3 hours, or even better, overnight. When ready to cook the meat, heat the butter and 4 tablespoons of the oil in a heavy bottom pot, add the onions and cook gently for 5 minutes until soft. Add the ginger, 3 tablespoons of the spice mix from the recipe you made earlier, and stir. Then add the tomato paste and stir again. Add the beef stock, bring to a boil. Reduce the heat, and simmer for 15 minutes. Pour the sauce into a food processor and blend thoroughly. Pass the sauce through a fine sieve into a bowl, and set aside. Preheat the oven to 325 F 160 C, gas 3. Reheat the pot over medium high heat, add the remaining oil, and once hot, add the cube meat and fry for several minutes until the meat is lightly browned. Pour the pureed sauce over the meat, bring to a boil, and cook, uncovered, for 5 minutes. Cover the pot with its lid and place in the middle of the preheated oven. Cook for 4 hours, stirring occasionally and making sure the meat is always covered with the sauce. If the sauce is drying up, add a little boiling water and lower the heat. After the 4 hours, remove from the oven, the meat should be soft and tender. If not, return to the oven for a little longer. Check the seasoning and season with additional salt, if needed. Before serving, chop the fresh cilantro and add to the stew.